Chuck in Vancouver, Canada writes to me. Hey, Paul. Hey, Chuck. I love my essay CDs and wish all my music was available in this format. Right on. Some respectable websites allow you to pay to download high-res music files in different formats, such as FLAC, WAVE, AIFF, and sometimes DSD. When I download a DSD file and send it to my receiver to play it, the receiver reports that it is receiving PCM88. Does wrapping a DSD file in a PCM envelope negate the advantages of DSD? Thanks for your help. Well, um, just so you know, pardon the mess. We're in the process of rebuilding Octave Studios upstairs in PS Audio, and we moved everything out of uh, this former area and stuffed it all in here. This will become the the lounge for the musicians to sit out here and drink coffee and do whatever musicians do. And if they're doing that, they're going to do it outside and then they can come back in, you know, because they, uh, yeah. okay. All right. Anyway. <laughs> um, but yeah, so I'll keep you up to date with how all of this is going. So I'm not sure that's exactly what's happening here. I, I suspect you might be listening to PCM. I don't know. It's, it's hard to say, but let's specifically answer your question. So when we wrap DSD in a PCM header, it is called DOP. So um, it stands for DSD over PCM. So DOP. And no, it is pure. So what we do is we take a chunk of DSD we put a PCM header and a footer onto it in this little package and send it on its way. The computer doesn't know any better, but when we recognize it in the DAC as DOP, we strip the header and the footer off and we leave the data intact, which is pure DSD. So no, adding that header uh, when you do DOP, it does not impact the sound quality of DSD whatsoever. And we do, we do it all the time, back and forth, not, not, not a problem. I, you know, if you had a PS Audio product, then I would tell you for sure you're not getting the, the right thing. Why? Well, because PS Audio products, whether it's, say, it's our Direct Stream DAC or our Stellar DAC, all of those will tell you exactly what it is you're listening to. We don't really care so much how it started. What's interesting to us, and I assume to you, is what is it you're actually playing. So all PS Audio products show you what you're actually listening to. So on a direct stream DAC, if you were to see, if you were to put DSD in for somehow, and you were to see 88 PCM, well, that's what you're listening to. And then if you had a, let's say, a program like Autovana or Rune, and you'd go into the settings of that, and you'd try and figure out well, why is it converting it to this? And it would be very helpful. And your program may do, or your piece of equipment may do exactly the same thing. I, I don't know, because I don't know this equipment, but I would certainly spend the time to look it up. Okay? All right. Good luck. Thanks.